Hi, I'm Jake White. A couple of years ago, I was lucky enough to coach the Springboks and we went on to win the World Cup. Today, I'm currently Director of Rugby at the Vodacom Bulls. So for me, my focus has changed. I want you guys that are youngsters to grow up to be the best rugby players you can. Today, Coach Joey is going to teach you how to score points in Baliki Rugby. Thanks, Jake. To help me with today's lesson, we've got two Vodacom Bulls players and Baliki. To play rugby, you need an oval ball and teammates. The players in the Vodacom Bulls team usually look different. Tall, short, stocky and slim. You and all your friends can play rugby because every position has an important role to help us win rugby games. In rugby, everybody matters. To score points in rugby, you can carry the ball or kick the ball. If you carry the ball over the opponent's goal line and touch it to the ground, you score what is called a try, and that is worth five points. In senior rugby, a try also has a superpower. If you score one, your team also gets a chance to try and score further two points by kicking the ball over the crossbar. This is called a conversion. You can kick three points by kicking the ball over the crossbar from anywhere on the field at any time in the game, which is called a drop goal. Or the referee could give your team a penalty kick, which is worth three points. If your team scores the most points by the end of the game, you win. What did we learn today? The Bulls rugby team consists of 15 players, but in Billiki rugby, you might only have six, seven or eight players in your team. We all play with an oval ball. And any player can score points by scoring a try. The next important thing about rugby is that you run forwards, but you pass backwards. That might sound funny now, but we'll tell you all about that on the next episode of Jake's Kickstart. <laughs>